Good afternoon. Today's message is entitled, Fear Not, He Holds Our Hand. When I awake every morning, I'm conscious that I do not know what the day has in store for me. And this has been made truer over the past three weeks with lockdown. How our lives have changed with the worldwide pandemic that has caused lots of uncertainty, fear, suffering, anxiety. However, I take comfort in the truth of God's word. Isaiah 41 and verse 13 says, For I, the Lord your God, will hold your right hand, saying to you, Fear not, I will help you. Today I'd like to encourage you with a few truths from God's holy word. In the book of Luke chapter 12 and verse 32, Jesus says, Fear not, little flock, your father is pleased to give you the keys to his kingdom. And we know that the Lord is our shepherd and that God's kingdom is one filled with peace, righteousness and joy. God rules and reigns over his kingdom and he wants us, his children, to enjoy all the good benefits that he has for us. He is a God of love, a God of mercy and a God of amazing grace. He is unchanging and he has placed us in and he has placed us in the kingdom of his light. We know him as our king, as a good father, one who never leaves us, never forsakes us, never disappoints us, especially not in times of trouble. The truth of who he is gives us hope. While we do not look at the things which are seen, but at the things which are not seen, for the things which are seen are temporary, but the things which are not seen are eternal. This is a passage of scripture found in the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 4. Yes, our lives have been changed. There have been disruptions, but through this, let us put our hand in his. Let us through this pandemic draw closer to God. I'd like to leave you with this passage of scripture to meditate on. It is found in 2 Corinthians 1 verses 3 and 4, and I'll read it from the message translation. It reads as follows, All praise to God and Father of our Master, Jesus the Messiah, Father of all mercy, God of all healing, God of all healing counsel. He comes alongside us when we go through hard times, and before you know it, He brings, he brings us alongside someone who is going through hard times so that we can be there for that person just as God was there for us. Thank you all for listening to this message. Amen and God bless you.